Hi, I'm Nicky Gumbel, and I really want to encourage you, as you think about the months ahead, the years ahead, to think about how you continue to reach people outside of the church. Jesus' commission, go and make disciples of all nations. How do we do that? And I've tried so many things. But for us, we found Alpha is the most effective way that we've we've ever tried. That's why we continue doing it. Pippa and I are on our 83rd small group in a row and we love it. It's just so exciting to see people encounter Jesus, be filled with the Spirit and invite their friends on the next course. We've been around at some of our church plants and was that each one of them is seeing growth. How have they done that? Primary reason is that they've run Alpha regularly and hundreds of people have come on those courses encountered Jesus, been filled with the Spirit, and joined their church. Of course, running Alpha, any kind of trying try to tell people about Jesus, can be discouraging at times. Sometimes uh, people invite their friends. About, only about a quarter of the people who are invited actually come. But think about that, the ones who do come. What a difference it makes to their lives. Barna Research found that 82% of people from outside of the church by the end of the course, if they completed the course, said they were followers of Jesus. And 91% who were already Christians at the beginning said they had a more intimate friendship with Jesus. And I love to watch that. That's why I wouldn't want ever to miss out being involved in a small group. I know not all pastors are able to have that privilege because they've got so many other things going on. But I would encourage you at very least to encourage your congregation to bring their friends. It's so exciting to be part of this together. And this really is like, we're all involved in, a, it's like a partnership, all of us from across the different churches seeking to see our nations evangelized, transformed through Jesus. And it's such fun to be doing this together. God bless you.